Hello, and welcome to this presentation on IDERA ER Studio's data lineage feature. My name is Anil Mahadev. I'm a senior solutions architect here at IDERA. So what is the agenda uh, for today? We'll be talking about what exactly is data lineage, why data lineage, data lineage versus visual data lineage, and we'll be wrapping this up with a demonstration. So what is data lineage? Data lineage helps you to identify the data origins uh, that from where it came from and how it moves over time. Data lineage provides greater visibility and flexibility in order to trace those errors back to the root cause in a data analytics process. Now let's say for example, if you're trying to uh, reverse engineer from a particular database and you wanna know where all uh, uh, the relationships are being present. ER Studio through data lineage cap can help you to leverage those areas. So for example, if you wanted to actually go ahead and know how exactly an SSIS package would be, you could use ER Studio's data lineage feature to do so. And it is also helping you to organize, structure, and model your data from multiple data sources, both relational and unstructured. So why data lineage? According to the BI network, a visual representation of data lineage helps you to track data from its origins to its destination. It also explains the different processes involved in the data flow and their dependencies. Also, the metadata management is the key input to capturing enterprise data flow and presenting data lineage as a whole. Now let's talk about how you can identify and see the difference between the data lineage capability versus the visual data lineage feature in data architect standard. The visual data lineage in, indicates that in ER Studio we have the data lineage tab which is primarily used to uh, document ETL processes from scratch. And this is often a manual process. A data lineage, on the other hand, helps you to uh, import ETL processes through its sophisticated bridges that automate the process for you. Some of the examples would be Microsoft SSIS, Informatica, IBM Data Stage, and many more. So with that, let's jump right into the demo. Here I have ER Studio Data Architect Enterprise Team Edition running. And with that, we supply you with a, a host of MetaWizard bridges, as well as the key data lineage uh, feature. So if you were to go to File, Import File from External Metadata, in this demonstration, we'll be taking a look at how to reverse engineer an SSIS package. So here I have a Microsoft SSIS package that I have. You can choose any one that you uh, have. Here you can see that we have a variety of other data sources that you can bring from. So here you have Oracle Data Integrator, and you can have any of the other data sources that you need. You have Informatica, you have MicroStrategy, and plenty more. So right now for this example, I'll be choosing Microsoft SSIS. Choose Next. And here I'll just give it a, a friendly name. Go ahead and click Next, and let ER Studio do the magic. At this point, what it's doing, it's actually processing that SSIS package that will give you both you know 
all the information from its control flow, its data flow, etc. And you can actually go ahead and click finish. Now let's turn our attention to the data lineage tab. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And I'm going to click on my orthogonal layout to see what it's brought to me. Here you can see you have a variety of, of packages and information about that package being displayed. So what I would like to do is I'll click on the zoom in the button and I'll zoom into this particular area. And here you can see I have my transformation being linked to the currency rate and the fact currency rate here. Now this is part of the uh, data lineage capability where it has automatically gone ahead and picked the relevant columns. So that's one of the coolest features in, in the data lineage area. Now here you can also go ahead and, and let your uh, ETL developers know what exactly you would like to have a business definition uh, for. So here you can go ahead and, uh, and bring all of that metadata as well. But here, if you wanted to go ahead and generate another uh, set of documentation metadata, you can go ahead and fill in uh, the business information as well. So that was how easy it was to work with the data lineage feature by bringing in an SSIS package. And The IDERA advantage is that our database lifecycle management solutions allow database and IT professionals to design, build, monitor, and improve data systems with complete confidence. And we are at the forefront of getting this latest and greatest technologies into the hands of our customers. I would like to thank you for attending this quick uh, demonstration on how to uh, look at the data lineage feature. If you have any questions, you can follow me on Twitter at SQL Server Cowboy or send an email to my email address for any further questions or request for any further uh, demonstrations. With that, I thank you for your time and have a good day.